Somewhere in here, so I just started checking. His car just hits 150 a lot faster than mine, so he created a big gap on me. And then when he took the mom L exit, he about killed himself. My supervisor's like, "Hey, you scanning?" Well, I saw y'all go by. I was sitting at McDonald's, and uh, so I saw y'all go by. And he's like, "Hey, they just got off mom L exit." I'm like, "Well, I'm at Morgan. Like, nobody's got off." And so I got off at White Oak, and one of our officers, "Hey, there's a matte color." Charger yeah. going the wrong way on the uh, on ramp, and so I was like, "Dude, I'm right here. Where is it?" <laughs> and then our sergeant's like, "Hey, he just passed me doing like 90." Uh, yeah. And so he ducked. He's gonna call the first spot. Well, the license plate doesn't match, so it's gonna sit in tow until he <laughs> let me know who he is. You get that, Ben? Y'all need anything from me? No. Um, Well, if you'll just, if you have a card or something, you can write I'll your name in. I'll rub it in for it, yeah. Just, I'll just... That's the guy that's going to have a little bit. It's going to be about me. Uh, two, Charles, three. Charles, you got to have a corner over here. David, John, Stiggle, John, Henry, one for the gate, four, eight. Hey, do y'all have any 24-hour contact with this apartment complex? I mean, he's got a freaking parking permit. Yeah, I won't see it here for a while. That's my cell phone number. Sorry, I don't have any cards. No, you're fine. I don't know whose car this is. Never seen it before, right? Just watching. Wasn't that dude that just walked that way, was it? I hear you. steal it. He brought it right back home. He thought he got away, but he didn't. Should go by that address on that Mustang, see if it's in the driveway. I guess I was running the Mustang or something. Well, so I ran. It was this one. There's an orange Challenger that had a a bad, like terrible 
fictitious tag, old, yeah. and then the Mustang. And uh, I ran this one, and then I was going to stop the, the temp tag. Mm -hmm. And then while well, they returned this one back to a Chrysler, I was like, mm. Yeah, I heard that. Yeah, I, heard <laughs> I was like, No. Three, I heard that, 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 that better. Uh, my car, though, it's... Did he almost lose it coming off the mill? Dude, he did. Like, there's freaking skid marks all down the side of it. Right. I thought, honestly, I slowed down quite a bit because I was expecting him to be off Got to shoot it in, to, in the trees, just the way he, the way he took it. With my car, I don't know. I don't know if it's just I was watching him pull away or if mine had some bad gas in it. It didn't really want to... It didn't really want to accelerate, but I mean that is a 392 SRT, so it should pull away. <laughs> it's probably a little. It's like he couldn't drive it though. I mean, obviously you just push the gas in a straight line. Anybody can do that. My kids can do that. You're probably just right here. I was in the beam field turn around. <laughs> I was hoping he just say get on 40. Well, yeah. if I, I think if I'd have been a little closer to him, I would have. No. But when I got off know, the white oak and I came, I didn't pass him. So they got pretty much Because these cars will hit about 110, about the, about the same speed. About the same speed as ours. But then once, once you get a little faster than that, it... So he just created that gap. That's what I was just about to ask. Yeah, 